We don't have any idea what Hyundai's planned division had for breakfast when they formed the new strikingly square-shaped look of the cutting-edge Saint Nick Fay, yet we trust there's a greater amount of it on that smorgasbord. The impending Saint Nick Fay is as ridiculously not quite the same as the old model as granola is from fried eggs. The upgraded one acquires a third column, with more back freight space and legroom. The Saint Nick Fay's new amplification is to draw in outdoorsy society, which is the reason the new SUVs work to oblige housetop tents, and for what reason its wide back end permits bigger experience gear. The new Saint Nick Fay is controlled by a turbocharged 277 horsepower 2.5 liter inline 4 with an 8 speed double grasp programmed transmission. There's likewise a Saint Nick Fay crossbreed, yet we survey that model independently. We'll refresh this space with evaluating, and whether the Saint Nick Fay's originality has fashioned better driving elements, whenever we've driven one. On the off chance that you can't as of now tell by simply looking, the 2024 Hyundai Saint Nick Fay is an immensely unique SUV. The sensational change results from both an all-new inside and rethought outside plan, the Saint Nick Fay's wheelbase has been expanded, its front shade has diminished, and since it has three columns of seating, there's definitely more space than previously. The new Saint Nick Fay goes discounted in mid-2024. Genuine valuing subtleties aren't accessible yet, however we expect the new Saint Nick Fay's intense hope to be joined by a huge expansion in beginning cost from the maturing active model. Indeed, even with the cost rise, we anticipate that the two-line Saint Nick Fay should stay more reasonable than the bigger three-column Hyundai Palisade. We expect a liberal contribution of standard elements for the base SE trim and, given the outdoorsy disposition of this new model, the mid-grade XRT will get some beautiful rad accessible bundles and extras. In the engine of each non-hybrid Hyundai Saint Nick Fay is a turbocharged 277 horsepower 2.5 liter inline 4 motor with 311 pound feet of force. Front wheel drive and an 8-speed double grip programmed are standard, yet all wheel drive is accessible. That implies the previous Saint Nick Fay's 191 horsepower base motor has been tossed out, giving Santa Claus more room for the section level trim. We haven't driven the new Saint Nick Fay yet to decide whether its new size and natural 277 horsepower powertrain are a decent match. Yet we'd figure Hyundai hasn't upset the loose yet extra striving recipe of the old model. Hyundai records the heaviness of the bigger three-line Saint Nick Fay at approximately 4,750 pounds, which is altogether more than the keep-going gen we had on our scales that weighed 3,858. We anticipate that that should fundamentally affect its exhibition. The EPA hasn't assessed mileage evaluations for the new Hyundai Saint Nick Fay yet. Whenever we've tried one, we refresh this space with the outcomes from our certifiable 75 mile per hour throughway driving test. To keep with its outside plan subject areas of strength for of square shaped, the main thing round inside the guts of the new Saint Nick Fay is the controlling haggle not many handles. The remainder of the space is typified by sensational square shapes. On the off-roady St. Nick Fay XRT trim, there's an undeniable impact of boxes and roughness from the Land Wanderer Safeguards cockpit. The first column has various spots to store things. There's even adequate space for the accessible double remote cell phone charger, that juices up two telephones in the mid-control area. A wide mouth pass through under that space looks ideal for an enormous satchel, large cubbies line the lower part of the entryway boards. Second and third line seats overlap level and there's even an environment control handle to change central air for those sitting as far as possible toward the back. Hyundai says there's 26 cubic feet of room behind the third column while it's being used, which is stunningly more than other three-line SUVs like the Mazda CX-90 and Toyota Great Highlander proposition. Covering the greater part the dashboard R2 12.3-inch shows. The check bunch is completely advanced, however the infotainment screen holds actual handles for things like environment and sound volume. The double remote cell phone charging cushions can repower two telephones immediately, however there are likewise USB-C ports for wired charging. 
We hope to see remote Android Auto and Apple CarPlay as standard elements yet won't be aware for sure until nearer to the St. Nick Faye's discounted date. The St. Nick Faye accompanies a lot of standard driver help innovation, including versatile voyage control and path-keeping help. Key security highlights include Standard forward crash advance notice and mechanized crisis slowing down. Standard versatile voyage control with unpredictable innovation. Standard path takeoff cautioning and path keeping help. Hyundai has one of the most outstanding guarantee anticipates the market featured by extended powertrain inclusion. The organization additionally now offers free booked upkeep that outclasses standard opponents like Toyota. Restricted guarantee covers 5 years or 60,000 miles. Powertrain guarantee covers 10 years or 100,000 miles.